What's up, mother suckers? Welcome back to another video. Thanks a lot for tuning in. I am back out here, Harbor Island, with my brother James and my little sister John right over there. We're out here, Harbor Island. This is gonna be my first evening session of 2020. We got choppers flying overhead. Check that out. So rude. I'm making a video down here and they're just gonna fly right over it. Like, come on, I, I need I need quality sound for my subscribers. But yeah, we're back out here, Harbor Island. It is Tuesday. James is out this morning and he hooked up on Bonito, his very first ever yep. Bay Tuna. Yep. And he's never caught one before. And he called me up, he's like, now I know why you call him Bay Tuna. I gave him a call right after work. I was like, yo, we need to get out there right now and try to get on some Bonito. Cause I, I've only caught only one Bonito this whole year. And I was a random bike cat. And also got a new bait to show you guys throughout the video. Um, here's a little sneak. These are called the Major Craft Jets. Ooh. I don't know if you guys ever heard of it, but I've been having these you know, laying around at home in storage for days like this when Bonito's biting in the bay. So I'm gonna give this a shot. I'm gonna try to figure out how to use this bait and hopefully catch a Bonito macro, spotty, barracuda, I don't know. And uh, yeah, nothing else to say, but let's get this day started, let's go. It's pretty damn windy right now. Let's see if we get something. You got bit again? And I apologize for the wind, dude. It's pretty damn windy. Here it is. 20 gram Jakpara Jet. That's a bony. That's a bony. That's a bony. Feels like one? go oh that's a bone <laughs> oh you snagged him typical I'm anticipating that run. Okay, I'm, I'm waiting for it. I'm trying to find what retrieve they like. I'm using a different bait. I'm using a jet. I'm gonna let it hit the bottom and I'm gonna burn it in. Maybe I need to go a little heavier and get it out there further. 20. Nah, maybe I need to get out there further. Maybe they are out there further. Yeah, I saw somebody follow your bait up. <laughs> a hit I don't know how this bait looks in the water I gotta check it out huh. it darts like a jerk bait it darts like a jerk bait. There we go. Yep. Man. On a pop. <laughs> Little guy, Saba. Okay. That little Nissan is a rogue. <laughs> First fish on the jet. Skunks off, fellas. Not the species we're looking for, but they're out there. Harbor, 
Let's go. Oh, there we go. There we go. That's a bony. It doesn't feel like a bony. He's not running. I don't know. Yeah, it's a bony. I think it's a bony. Wants to be a big ass Mac? <laughs> oh! On the side! Oh, you that? I guess he swam into it. He already looked at it. But you know what's the difference? What? Actually landed mine. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> I'm just doing it your way, man. Get him on the side. <laughs> He looked at it, okay? He rubbed my bait. He sniffed it, got a taste of it. <laughs> Bleed him out. Bleed him out. <laughs> Dude, on the jet too. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if they're hitting deep or not. Can't really tell. Oh, it's working the surface right there and I gotta let it sink. Are you on? No, I think I'm hung up on myself. Barracuda! That's three species in this wind. And you were just saying Barracuda too. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to switch it up. So, I got that guy on the Jakpara Jet 20 gram, which is this bait right here. You guys are wondering. Okay. It's a nice bait. When you pop it, it pops like a, um, a jerk bait. So I'm going to bump it up to 30 gram. This one is the pink color. Yeah. Jigpara Jet. 30 gram pink. Since everyone's throwing blue and white. Just see if I can uh, switch it up. See what happens. I'm going to try to rig it directly to the bait. See if it swims different. Nothing yet? I'm going to try pink. Since you guys are throwing blue and white. I'm chucking these irons on the 7.4 medium light. This rod handles it pretty well with the Daiwa Zillion SVTW. Oh, I just got smacked on a dead stick, yeah. Come on. Somebody hit it on a on a drop. Cause I was letting the line out and I see it twitching. Engaged it, then the line just went. Yeah. Macro. Yeah. What are they made of? No. Irons, bro. They just cut differently. They like when you pop it, it, it scoops like a jerk bait. 
And I noticed the best way to rig them is directly to the bait, not the O-ring. These, yeah. That was way out there too. Got hit again on the drop. Whoa, from the, from the sound of it, it doesn't look like you're gaining. Is it a halley? Dude, that's the smallest halibut ever. <laughs> Dang. James just landed a baby halibut, size of a deck of cards. Hey, if there's one around, there's more around. He didn't even fight, huh? He's like, oh, he got me. <laughs> It was the cast of a lifetime, man. I never seen my bait fly that far in my life. <laughs> that thing went boom, bye. It jetted off. <laughs> the Jigpara jet jetted off. Gone forever. But there's bait boils over there. Oh! He'll be swimming towards you. Oh, it is, it is, it is. Yeah, see? Don't bust the can. Don't bust the can. Ah, It's all good. It's all good. Your skunk's off. Times two. <laughs> there you go, little Mac. Looks like we're making a move. We're going to move to the island prime side of Harbor Island. Over here was okay. We we're hooking up. Macro, Barracuda, Halibut, and Bonito. So four species, not even the bass, so we're not even tripping. We got what we wanted, which is Bonito. Success, but we want more. So the new bait, the Major Craft Jet, it's pretty good. I mean, I wanna fish it a little bit more. I'm actually probably gonna end up fishing that bait this whole video. If you guys wanna know more about that bait, check the description below. Check out the Major Craft website. Check out their Instagram. They have it up on there. If you guys are interested in that bait, check it out. So yeah, we're already here at spot number two. There's already a couple people fishing, some kids. A gentleman, yeah, we're just gonna give it a shot right here. But that gonna test you guys go. Closing it out right there. We are calling it a day. These guys killed it though. He caught how many bonitos? Three, right? You caught three bonitos. John caught three. You caught one. I caught one. So that's the limit for John. And we <laughs> caught, a, caught a handful of mackerel, but overall it was it was an all right day. I mean, set my goal. My goal was to come out, catch a bonito in the bay at Harbor Island. And it was a success in my book. I mean, I'm happy about that. Well, the day for me, <laughs> started declining it went it started off high i mean i was high not that kind of high but i was high having fun catching fish and next thing you know it just started going down lost one bait lost two bait lost the jerk bait then I'm, i don't know what it is but i think i think it was just me you know it's always the operator i'm not gonna blame the gear i'm gonna blame myself for breaking off uh, but it yeah, is what it is pretty windy too. yeah it is pretty damn windy i mean I'm gonna apologize for that if if the sound to this video comes out with the <laughs> I'm sorry, right? <laughs> I'm gonna apologize. But uh yeah, the bit on the uh Major Craft Jet, Major Craft Standard. No, you, standards oh yeah. Slow. Both of them were throwing standards, James was throwing the slow, I was throwing the jet. I dedicated like 95% of the video to the jet, then I moved over to the standard with the blade, no success. Then I moved over to the jerk bait, no success. That was a complete failure. But we caught Bonito, check it out. That fat one right there, all me, all me. <laughs> <That's good. laughs> Just kidding. The big bonito was uh, John. It's not like crazy big, but it's pretty big for a bay bonito or bay tuna, you want to call it. And then again, James did catch his very first bonito today. So congrats to him. Thank you, Kudos. Thank you. And shout out for John coming out last minute, right after work. Literally, we both got off work, got our stuff together, and came out and did some good old bay fishing. 
and yeah try not that new bait the major craft jet there you go if you guys are wondering where to get these you can check your local tackle shops you can check out hook bait and tackle they may have some in stock these are new to the market and the way you work them is similar to a jerk bait slash iron you can pop it it'll cut just like a jerk bait and you can just slow retrieve it you know what yeah. I'm gonna just tell you like I tell everybody else. How do you work these baits? You go out there, you figure it out. No one's gonna hold your hand through the process of fishing because fishing is a constant learning curve. You are learning something new every single day, it's true. But yeah, so the Major Craft Jet is it's a pretty cool bait. I mean, I lost my only pink one. I literally only have four in my stock and I just didn't wanna lose any more. So I took it out and put it away. I think I did. Oh wait, I lost the other one too. I think you lost two jets. But yeah, I'm going to sum it up right there, guys. Everything I use in this video will be in the description below. Be sure to check that out. If you enjoy bay videos, yeah, pretty much just bay videos, drop a thumbs up, hit the subscribe, hit the bell notification buttons if you guys want updates on new videos. Follow me on Instagram. Also, shoot me a DM if you guys want to chop it up, learn some things, got any questions or anything like that. Maybe I can learn something from you guys. Maybe you guys can learn something from me. But again, it's always good to be out with the guys. We're missing three other dudes, but it is what it is. We're gonna try to do some more bay fishing this upcoming week and hopefully pump out some dope content for you guys and create memories with, you know, good company. So that's pretty much it, guys. Again, check the description for everything I use in this video. Well, hopefully everything. And yeah, as always, good fishing and peace the hell out.